first, uh, first of all, I want to say something. When you're talk, when you're talking the best, anything, anything that is in the best, right? So everything, put it in the best, even if he's still alive now, okay? For example, if he, 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 if he was your friend in the best, and he's still friend with you today. So in this case, you're going to use the present perfect. All right. So you would say, we have been friends for five years. So till now, we are friends. But if you want to talk about him like in the best, and you don't have a connection with him now, or you were friends in the best, but you're not friends now, so you gotta say he was a good friend to me, and we had a great time, and so on. Uh, we had studied together, or we studied together uh, five years, and and so on. But okay. it, uh, yeah, so yeah, so it's like that. It's very easy and, si and simple. All you need to do is say it again. I have been a good friend uh, called Kamal. Uh, he's really a good friend. We are, we have been when, right? We have been when to school together. We have been to school together. If you say we have been, it means that you went, you know, and you still. Go, 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 like, like, go now. You're still in school now. You have been, like, five, you, for example, if the school is five years old, five years, and five years, for example, and the first year, the second, the third, the fourth, all right, and you are in the last year, for example, so you're going to say, we have been school for five years together. So, what I'm going to ask you now are you still going to school? <laughs> of course. Of course. You, you study no. now. You graduate. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, no. So, you in this case, you better use the past perfect, which we're talking about, you know, action that started first in the past, um, in a, in amount of time, all right? That not really specific. Okay, so you could say we had, we had been friends, if he's not your friend now, or we had studied together, all right, for a long time. Or, if you want to specific that time, you better use the symbol past, which will be we studied together five years, specific details, specific time and places and so on. Can I can I use post simple in in all the conversation? Yeah, if you want to use the simple best in all conversation, okay, but it has to be in the past. Things that started in the past and also ended in the past. It has no connection at the present time or the future. Okay, but present okay. perfect, but present perfect started in the past, but has an effect. Alright, or an action at the present time. Yeah. So, for example, if some, if the mom uh, sees her her uh, child, and she tells him, "Hey, watch out!" So her boy would say, "Oh, I'm sorry, mom. I've cut my finger. I have cut my finger," meaning. That like one minute ago, you know, accident accidentally he cut his finger, and does he have his finger now? I don't, I don't think so, right? So the effect of the past happened at the present time, which is now. And Im people imagine that the past or simple past it's something like ten years ago or five years ago, like three months ago. No. The symbol best can be one minute ago, one second ago. All right. 
So the the present perfect here is like you know short time ago, whatever. You can use it like short time ago or long time ago, till now. Okay, can I ask you a question? Like, ah, go ahead. Uh, what's the difference between uh, past simple and present perfect? Well, present perfect, uh, simple past. Present simple, you are present simple. Present simple talks about things in general, like what is your name, how how are you. No, past simple, simple. simple, all right. Past simple or simple past talks about things that happened in the past, and also ended in the past. There is no no connection at the present time or the future. There is no connection. The present perfect has connection to the present time has so I've got my finger I've called you today I've had lunch today I have had lunch meaning that for example in the morning I have had lunch I had lunch all right so someone of your friends tell you hey uh, are you hungry so you're telling him no I'm not hungry I have just had lunch like it was like five minutes ago you know I had lunch so that's a connection between the past to the present time. This is the present perfect. It has many usages, but anyway, just a note, simple note on um, the conversation. It's a conversation, so I'm just giving you, uh, it's a conversation course, so I'm just giving you simple notes on the grammar so you can focus more on the conversation. But if there was any mistake or any grammar mistakes or understanding of it, I'll try to help you as much as I can. Okay.